Very well. We shall do it. It is almost 10.30. I can leave now and find a carriage. I can be back here with my things packed in two hours' time. At 12.30, on the dot, you must be ready and waiting. Can you do that? Oh, I can do anything, my dear. Now, we must think carefully of how we will word your letter. What, what letter? By the letter we leave for your father. Shall I write it for you? No. You must be very clever in it. You must melt his heart. You must make him feel your no, love and affection. No, I will not write him. Well, of course we will write him. We want him to forgive us. Oh, no, please don't, Morris. Please. please don't. He won't forgive us ever. I know it now. I have good reason, too. What reason? My father doesn't like me. What an unhappy thing to say. You must not think such things. Yes, it is true. No, Catherine. Your father is disappointed that his plans have not turned out the way he wanted. He is perhaps hurt and angry with us both, but that will pass. It won't pass. Catherine, if I am to be your husband, you must begin to trust in my judgment, to rely on me. Oh, I do, Morris. That's right. How many times do you think that fathers have spoken angrily with the daughters that they love, particularly when marriage is the question? 